What is up guys? Today we're gonna to take a look at another new nifty AI art tool that takes any image and converts it to anime. That's right, ladies and gentlemen, we have reached the peak of human technology. There will never be anything as amazing as these magic Chinese algorithms that turn any image into anime. So for those of you that want to follow along or just play with this tool on your own time, it is located at h5.tu.qq.com forward slash web forward slash AI2D forward slash cartoon forward slash index. Now I know some of you are thinking, man, I ain't clicking that shit. I ain't going to this site. This looks like a virus link if I have ever seen one. And frankly, you're probably right. These gals down here on this index page, they are definitely giving me some serious CCP hacker vibes, but luckily I, along with most of you watching, have the power of GNU slash Linux at our disposal. Personally, I'm running Arch by the way, along with the Brave browser and I'm behind seven proxy. So this should be enough meme magic to protect me. And I've also taken the precaution of updating my desktop's wallpaper. So if any CCP glowies do manage to get through all of my proxies and get a reverse shell on my desktop, then they're going to be forced to close the connection the moment they see this. Now, for those of you following along on the desktop, you might notice when you first visit the site that it's completely broken. It might look something like this, and that's because you need to install a font to allow Chinese characters on the site because it's all in Chinese. Uh, so you could just install Noto Fonts CJK on Linux like I did, which includes Japanese and Korean fonts along with simplified and traditional Chinese fonts, or you could just install the Chinese fonts only if you don't want to bloat your system up with the others that you don't need. Now, after you install the fonts, you might still have some trouble with navigating the page, like finding buttons and stuff like that. And that's because for whatever reason, whoever made this web app didn't really design the desktop version of it correctly. So when you access it from desktop, it's kind of hard to navigate, but when you access it from your phone, it works a whole lot better. That's probably because spyware tends to be more effective on phones than computers these days. After all, people tend to take their smartphones with them everywhere, but we can make this easy to navigate on a desktop by just installing a handy dandy user agent spoofer. So this is able to let me take my GNU slash Linux machine and LARP as an Android phone. So let's get started with turning some pictures into anime. We gotta click this big old button right here. And then, uh, well, I guess if you can read Chinese, then you know what to press. But next we press this one here and then we upload an image. So. Let's start with this picture here of two of my heroes. On the right, we've got Alex, who goes around protecting frogs and other small woodland animals from chemicals that get leaked into the water and cause the animals to engage in homoerotic behaviors. And in his free time, he likes to red pill normies on the globalist agenda. And on the left is Ye, who says he came here to do the same thing that Jesus did 2000 years ago, which is, forcefully remove the money changers from the temple, so to speak. Uh, so let's go ahead and turn these brave heroes that did nothing wrong into anime. And you can see, it's actually pretty quick. And wow, let's see what we've got here. Our brave heroes have been turned into some anime characters. Uh, so it looks like it gave Alex some kind of a camera i guess or it's like a it's like a dual lensed camera it, it took his microphone and turned into like a dual lensed camera and it almost kind of looks like i don't know like a game controller and a camera in one not really sure what's going on there and and yay yay is looking uh rather regal there so why don't we go ahead and save these images and i'll show them to you guys in a sxiv so that we get a little bit more zooming going on. Yeah, look at that. Pretty cool. I'm actually surprised it worked with Ye since he's got his uh, superhero mask on right now. And 
just in the testing that I've done with this app, it seems to not really work too well when it can't see people's faces, but hey, I mean, it worked fine. Maybe it's because it saw Alex's face just fine, and it's like, hey, let's go ahead and actually try to render this image out. All right, let's try another image. Let's pick something good. Hmm. Oh, let's try this one. This is a young Terry Davis, my friend and yours, and he's looking pretty good in this picture, so his anime self should also be looking pretty good. Oh yeah, I'd say that's a pretty good picture. Let's go ahead and save that one, and um, let's see, I think this kinda opens it up, but again, it stretches it out, makes it look a little bit weird. So I'll just open it in SXIV for you guys. And look at that. That could be somebody's husbando right there. Pretty good anime. All right, let's do something else. Oh, you know what? I know what I'm gonna do next. It's risky. It's risky giving this kind of data to the CCP, but I'm willing to risk it. I'm willing to bet my OPSEC is good enough. Let's try one of my deep fake selfies. Let's see what it does. It doesn't identify me. I don't know if that's a good thing or a bad thing. <laughs> Let's try it again. All right, it looks like, okay, it looks like it took it that time. Yeah, sometimes they um, they don't take it. Okay, this is, <laughs> this is very interesting. All right. Um, I guess we'll download that or we'll view it in here, view it where it's a, a weird aspect ratio. So it looks like it made some uh, slight alterations. Looks like the one on my right has a slightly higher credit score, but forgot how to cook with spices. <laughs> and wow, turned him into a king and shit. Wow, pretty cool. My anime character is on some king shit. All right, let's try some more. Let's do... Let's see what happens if I feed anime into, into itself. What happens if anime goes through the anime filter? Oh, didn't work that time. Let's try it again. Is it going to make it look more realistic? <laughs> It might not take it. Hmm. Let's see. I think I have another anime that I can try. Um, let's do this one. Will it accept it? Oh, it's taken this one. All right. Let's see what happens when you run anime through the anime filter. Uh, it kind of did actually, like, the eyes look more, I don't know, anime-ish, is that a word? They look more anime-ified. There's all these colors and stuff going on with it. Or I don't know, I guess it's a, just a different style and there's more texture going on in the hair, but now she has no mouth. Or her mouth is just like this little thing there. And also her nose is, her mouth and nose are more gone and her face just kinda overall seems to have less expression in it. It's like all of the expression in the rest of her face just went into her eyes. Yeah, don't really, don't really like that one. I don't think it does good when you run a double anime on it. <laughs> Let's see, I think I might have another, another anime picture from my meme garden, like this one. Ah, oh, what? went to 99% and then rejected it. See, the magic Chinese algorithms, they're a little bit jank. They don't always work. All right, let's 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 try something else. Let's, let's try an image like, um, well, let's do the Richard Stallman, since that's what was popped up, popping up first in the folder. Looks like it worked. I guess it detects beards okay. Wow, my guy is looking is looking regal. This is this is officially the new Richard Stallman, guys. Whew. 
Hoo-hoo. This is what peak GNU looks like, my friends. That's that's a good image. This one's this one's gonna be used in uh this one might be used in the thumbnail. Or in a future thumbnail at least. Yeah, definitely moving that one into one of the nicer meme gardens. Alright, let's let's make some more some more animes. Let's get some good ones. A couple more good ones. Um <laughs> Let's see <laughs> if the magic Chinese algorithms can fix this mess that is Elon Musk's hair when he was like in college. Or I think this was right after college. I wonder if it's going to make him look like uh, Master Roshi or something. What the hell? It like put it put a neural link. <laughs> it put a neural link in Elon Musk's head. Oh, this is this is the best. This one's definitely getting saved. <laughs> Look at this, guys. It, put, it, put a, it gave him his hair back. <laughs> but at the cost of the Neuralink. He's part of Skynet now. Oh, that's that's the best. All right, let's let's do some more. One more. Um. Hmm. What do I got? Oh yeah, this is a good one. Trump playing catch. This is this Trump playing catch with Baron. Baron's got a hell of a fucking arm. In case you didn't know. What? What do you mean you can't identify it? What are you what are you talking about? Try another pitcher. Well, what do you mean? Why would that pitcher not work? See, this this is what I'm talking about, guys. These 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 algorithms, they're a little bit jank. This is why they need to be GPL. If they were free and open source, then someone out there might be able to make them not be jank. Yeah, now it's, ah, seriously? One more time. One more time on this meme and then we gotta, we gotta pick another one. Cause we can't, we can't end on a flop. All right, we're gonna do, <laughs> this makes no sense that it can do yay, but it can't do Trump. <laughs> But okay, um, hmm, let's see, good one. Actually, okay, now I'm curious, will it do this one with the mask? Of course not. All right, um, let's do this guy. And it worked. All right, and wow, this one's actually pretty good too. That's like, like a legit character that you would expect to see in an anime. Right? Like what, what anime is this character in? I don't know. I've only seen like just a handful. <laughs> Despite what you might think after seeing this video, I've only seen a handful of animes, but I, I think I've seen one that literally had a character that looked like this. I just can't remember uh, what it is. If you know what anime this character is from, let me know in the comments below, and also leave a like and share this video to hack the algorithm. And have a great rest of your day.